investigation has revealed the illegal use of the police forces to investigate Catalan political parties and stifle the independence movement. This is Catalan News in 100 seconds. Top officials from the Spanish police who reported directly to the Interior Minister illegally investigated pro-independence figures under the instruction of the conservative Spanish government led by Mariano Rajoy. This was carried out for five years and was financed with public money. Amb aquests espionatges que, com deia, hem patit els independentistes pel simple fet de ser independentistes i que fins i tot han patit presidents de, de la Generalitat de Catalunya. Per tant, serà una prova del cotó pel govern de Pedro Sánchez Housing groups from across Spain presented the Barcelona Declaration today, a proposal of changes to housing policies to reduce evictions, make housing more affordable and avoid gentrification. We have discussed how this is affecting the social cohesion of the barrios, uh, affecting at all levels, affecting also the economic activity. The Climate Action Department has proposed transferring water from the Ebra River to drought-stricken areas in the country to ensure agricultural activity can continue. Asian Group Hire has announced that it still intends to acquire 20% of the Chinese company Shanghai RAAS, currently in the hands of Grifols. Spanish airline Iberia has proposed creating a new handling subsidiary which would be owned by Iberia's parent company. The Tres Toms parade season has kicked off in Catalonia amid new animal welfare guidelines. The voluntary regulation is aimed at protecting the horses and donkeys that traditionally take part in the festivities. Parades were seen over the weekend with more planned for Wednesday.